Look! It magically got a floating TV screen! Play. I've already played the first level. I've played the first, like, six. Play through Green Hill Zone. Actually, I lied. Not the first six, the first five. Oh, that's not... Okay. Alright. Classic. Okay. Is it just me? Or was this... Did, the, did it always sound like this? Like the jump? Uh... Just uh, letting you know, the video is gonna look a little weird there because I forgot to put it on 16.9, but I did just now. Uh, it, really? It was only for a little bit, and it's it not was that for like 11, 12 minutes. It's not that bad. Uh, it's not that bad. Just calm down. No, you just screwed up this entire. <laughs> I want to get up there. I'm not trying to do this. Oh my gosh! Fine. The FIRST CLASSIC INVERTED LOOP! And the rings that he got. Except... You're not going Super Sonic. I will go Super Sonic, even if it wasn't invented in this game. Oh, I didn't get a special stage. You didn't have to. Wait, isn't he supposed to run off? Sometimes. No, not in Sonic 1. I'm almost positive he does. Nope. I'm gonna prove you wrong. Well, I mean, if you run off, then he does. No, I did just run off. Well, like... Anyways. Oh, yeah, the spikes before. in this game. Those are annoying. What I was saying before, um... And those fish. Kingdom Hearts is one of my favorite game series. And those palm ever. trees. And, um... Rings. What? I did not press over. I hate your controller. Suck this game. I hate your controller. If I was using a Genesis controller, this would be so much easier. Well, no shit. <laughs> But, um... Ah! You're invincible. I know, but I you mean, can fall between those things. I mean, sparkly. I mean, like, because those platforms aren't solid right there. Here, I'll just demonstrate. See? I did that a lot. I never knew that. I did that a lot. Why did you do that a lot? <laughs> because I would fall onto the spikes with invincibility, and then I'd just accidentally run off. Oh. I didn't know that. Anyways, I found out that the, uh... Kingdom Hearts in oh, that's the end. <laughs> Kingdom Hearts in English has a lot of awesome voice actors. Like, so there's the obvious Haley Joel Osment, Dim, 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 as <laughs> okay, as Sora and Vanitas. Oh, I thought I would fall there too. And uh, and Haley Joel Osment, Dim, 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 is. The it, he's most known for being the kid in the Sixth Sense. He was also Forrest Gump's son, and yeah, other stuff. <laughs> I didn't even know that was there. I didn't either. Ah, I forgot about that. Okay, I'll get a life. And um, da, 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 da. the voice of Diz in Kingdom Hearts Three: Chain of Memories, and there's a there's a breakable wall right there. Really? Yes. Yeah. Right there? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I never knew that, Al. But, uh, the voice of Diz is Christopher Lee, I think. Right? I don't know. Why are you asking me? You found this out and told me yesterday. Oh, right. Um, yeah, Christopher Lee, who plays Saruman and Screw Count Dooku. Points in Star Wars, well, in Lord of the Rings and Star Wars, respectively. And, um... The first boss of Sonic. Ever. Ah! Oh, it's so menacing. one of my favorite things ever. <laughs> I know what you're saying. Spock was the voice of Master Xehanort in Birth by Sleep. And that's just awesome. <laughs> and, uh, Master Ericus. That's voiced by Mark Hamill, also known as Luke Skywalker. Yeah. Yeah! Alright, well, I think that's enough of this. Okay. Um, I'm gonna quit the second Genesis. You know, we'll probably end up splitting this video somewhere. No, because our finale in whatever it was was like 40 minutes long. Yeah, but that's a little... It'll be fun to watch. I don't know, I'll, I'll decide about it. Well, it's it only gonna... 
I mean, we don't have that much else to do. Yeah, I'll go fight your boss. Emma is... okay. Wait, no, because we still have the credits and the cutscenes and... And those take forever. Yeah. We'll be done before 30 minutes, most likely, if I start. It's already past 30 minutes, isn't oh, it? Oh, right. Because you screwed up. Shut up! <clears throat> yeah, we're gonna split this up somewhere. No, we're not. It'll still be the finale. It'll just be finale part one and finale part two. Whatever. So picky. I'm just trying to make this viewer friendly. But what if the viewers aren't friendly? Well, then they can go fuck themselves. Oh, right. I totally All right. forgot. We're going to play some awesome music here, so we'll meet you in the stage. All right. All right. Let's do this. It is on! This will be the most epic final boss ever. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Wait. This isn't right. Um. Well. Goodbye. This is embarrassing. And we're here! Again. On hard mode, with the time eater, and the most epic music that came from this entire game. Even though it wasn't technically Not in this game. This is the remix of the Sonic 3 final boss music. From Sonic 3. But it... This was in Sonic Generations for the, the 3DS. 3DS. They... They... The entire game is different on the 3DS, apparently. Pretty much. And they added in Big Arms, which is like that impossible boss from Sonic 3. Not Sonic, not Sonic and Knuckles, like the Sonic 3 one that was- Oh my god, I totally forgot you could do that. But- Throw the other Sonic? Oh my gosh, really? Yeah. You forgot. If you hold it- A. Press. Pre you can hold. Ah. Get you... back here! No! 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 Get back here. If you press A while, um, I don't know if Sonic's just kind of like floating there. If you press A, you shoot the other Sonic. Yeah, sorry, I kept getting interrupted. <laughs> <laughs> it's not that hard to complete the sentence. Oh no, a warping armor attack, I'll just keep going. Yay. This boss is not that much harder. He's just harder to, like, harder to get to. That's it. I really kind of don't like... Like, I guess it goes with the whole Super Sonic Invincible thing. But I kind of like in the other game... Why can't I move to the left and right? See? That's what happened to me! You said up and down. And then I said, well, pretty much every direction. But, um... I like how in the other modern games... Or Sonic games, he... Could actually get hurt by the final boss. Kind of. Well, you'd lose rings. And yeah. I, I kind of like that because it made the challenge a lot more difficult, but it didn't really make too much sense with Super Sonic. Because he, you know, stuff. I think it made sense to have a difficult boss. Yeah. This is pretty much just hold X until you get to him. Yeah. Maybe move up and down or left and right a few times. Uh, what? No! Get caught by that and you won't be able to move! By what? No. <laughs> What? I just was about to ask that. Okay, so back to this song. It was remixed by, was it Cash Cash? I believe so. And I want to say, I saw somewhere that Crush 40 did it too, but I don't think that's right. I don't know. I'll... If Crush 40 did do it, it'd make that song this more aw that more This song that much more awesome! I will look it up. Alright, but, um... Uh... Yeah, this song for me, I mean, I was kind of skeptical a little bit on Cash Cash, like I liked them. Cash Cash. But this song for me put them almost at Crush 40 level. Like, they just cash. that awesome. Okay, it was only Cash Cash? Yep. Alright. It's attacking. No way! It's Pump. a warping arm attack! Ooh. Uh, so... My mind is pretty much exhausted today. Uh, nobody cares. I care. Nobody I, cares. We took our... Where did I say Standardized tests. Let's call it CAX. It's Kentucky. Kentucky? Yeah. Remember, I said we were... Oh, wait. Who said know. that? I said that, but in one of the Saints Row videos. 
They live in McKinney, Kentucky. At least I think I think it's Kentucky. What? Let me check. Uh, okay, was... why am I going? Like I'm not going forward. Oh no, time energy is building. What does that mean? It means I throw Sonic. Um, I don't know, I just remember there was a McKinney in some other Okay, state. well, we should probably commentate about the game. And I'm pretty sure it's Kentucky. But we took our standardized test, and then immediately after that, I had to take my AP mock exam for U.S. history. Uh, which was three essays, and then 80 Stop months. moving! What are you doing? Moving. It almost seems like you don't boost near as fast if you shoot Sonic for some reason. Cause you don't have the power of- He's not- The heart boosting. of the cards? Wait, why is the other Sonic going the same speed? He's not boosting. Heart of the cards. And... Death blow! Kind of. Not really. I'm gonna do this and see if it works. Were all of your hits in- Yes. Wait, you're not done. I know. It's... I just gotta... This. I guess I'll finish this classic Sonic, just to give it a little classic value. Oh, die away! I thought that was supposed to be like a ball. It was, kind of. I don't know. That was just a crescent. What just happened? Um... Wait. What? 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 I'm confused. Finish? I don't... Um... Okay. Oh, that was perfect timing with the music, though. Oh, yeah! I found out! This song is universal final boss music. It works with everything. You know, I just noticed, I've never finished this boss as classic. Neither have I, until I... a couple... Justin weeks ago. <laughs> Alright, uh, we're gonna turn this music off really quick. Which, it's on his Zune, by the way. It's not actually in the game. Zune! Yeah, his Zune. Cause Zunes are awesome. Wait, Wait, pause it. We have, to, we have to let the song finish. No! Ish. It's almost done. No! Da -da. Wait. It starts over right there. But, anyways. Here's the cutscene that I didn't mess up. You. Chili Dog! <laughs> Why does it have a bow on it? It's I mean, that just present. seems like it'd be disgusting. And it'd get all messy. I mean, Chili plus. I plus can't remember. Did I ask my question about time travel during the stage? Oh, yeah, I did. I did it before. Yeah. Amy's really strong. <laughs> well, have you seen the size of a freaking hammer? Alright. Why doesn't he know? Tails does the same exact thing! Does forgetting have two teeth? Yeah. It just doesn't look right. It doesn't look right with one T either. Maybe it's just not a word. Maybe not. Ha! <laughs> it's funny because it's a time travel joke. Failure. Oh, shit. Uh, I'll be back in like two seconds. I forgot to stop my dad. I'm sorry. Ah, I'm falling. Now, what would you do if I accidentally turned off the Xbox? <laughs> <sighs> okay, well, considering he's most likely not gonna be here. For the credits. Enjoy your future. It's gonna be great. We. I guess we'll just start the credits over. But okay, we'll cut right here. So he's back. No, I'm not. You. We can't do a proper game outro without both of us. Here. Oh. No, I, I just mean the audience wouldn't like it. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least they enjoy me. Probably not. I enjoy me. Probably not. No. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, 
these credits are pretty cool. It goes through pretty much every stage in this game, and it kind of shows how Sonic evolves and stuff. What's this? Oh, did you watch Sonic Generation Shorts? Yeah. <laughs> oh, What's yeah. This? <laughs> That's my favorite part. <laughs> Classic Sonic's evolving. Oh, yeah! This is happening! <laughs> that was pretty funny. So yeah, that's all we do. That was that. That was you know, a good game. I like how in their uh, choosing of the stages, they didn't choose a stage from the actual sequel to Sonic Two. They chose it to the sequel to the sequel. <laughs> what was the sequel to Sonic Two? Sonic Three. Oh yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was thinking, you know how, yeah, I already I said this, I'm on the same mindset that Sonic and Knuckles and Sonic 3 are the same. Yeah, game. I know, so do I, but they don't list it as Sonic 3 and Knuckles. Yeah, I guess, uh... Ha! <laughs> <laughs> I used to hate when that happened. Yeah. <laughs> no, I, I'm the only one that can sing this. <laughs> that was pretty good. Yeah. Hey, hey, CJ. What? Up and down and all around? No! That helicopter looks like it's ceramic. I love this remix of the song because it sounds cool. So, you know what? What? I got to thinking about something. We did horrible oh, in this yeah. game. Oh, yeah. Throughout the entire thing. Very bad. Yeah, most definitely. So, I've been thinking of a way to redeem ourselves. Oh? Huh? I challenge you to a race through the entire game. You're on. We... What I was thinking is just race through all of the stages, classic and modern... Just the stages, not the boss battles or the missions, because nobody wants to do those again. Oh, come on, you don't want to play against Vector? You don't want to play against Egg Dragoon? Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> Set you free. I just realized something. This is not This is a different remix. This isn't a remix. This is the original. No, it's different. The guitar's different. So... You hear it? Yeah. Alright, so... Weird. I guess we're gonna race? Yes, we are going to race! So and I guess we will race for redemption! For redemption. For redemption! I feel like we should have some kind of alcohol when we say that. For redemption! No. Shot. I mean, it... it I don't like how that transitions. Like, it sounds like it should end, and then it's just like, HORRIBLE SONIC GAME MUSIC IS HERE! Are you saying it's a horrible Sonic game, or it's a horrible Sonic game music? I mean, I guess it fit with the stage, but I just don't feel as sonic -y. I don't know, that, that entire game think... just didn't... I, I like the game, but there were a lot of parts that didn't do it for me, like Seaside Hill. Like, Haunted Mansion as Chaotix? Oh yeah. I, I don't. I didn't really like the entire chaotic story in general. Like I, I, I think it was a cool idea, but just the way they did it, then. Yeah, it's not very Sonicy. Find the ten crabs. Oh, I've gone through the entire stage four times. Where's that last crab? Oh, you're telling me it's off the stage onto the side and a platform that you normally can't go to? Okay, thanks for telling me. Assholes. <laughs> no. <laughs> What was mean is put out 50 flames using Espio's oh. ability to yeah. make tornadoes. What? I missed one? Whoa! And yeah. then there was that one that was way up, like, right near the ceiling that you would never find unless you were really looking for it. Yeah. They just did that to piss you off. Oh, so, yeah. Sonic 06. So, uh, I watched some gameplay, like, glitching trailers, and, um, I never noticed, but you know in, uh, Wave Ocean, at the big loop thing? Yeah? You Wait, normally run, one? like, the 
woman the, the end? You let you run up and loop around and the end one? I, it doesn't matter which one. Okay. You're usually running full speed when you go through that, right? Yeah. Oh yeah, you speed up like exponentially. No. No. You can walk up it <laughs> yeah. and stand <laughs> on the ceiling. <laughs> <laughs> it's Nintendo logic wait physics or Sega. Sega. <laughs> <laughs> Physics, <Sega. laughs> you know. Wait, it's Nintendo. Oh wait, this is Nintendo. I better say physics. <laughs> it's Sega physics. <laughs> you know, stuff. We're not at the redemption part yet, so I can screw up as much as I want to here. Okay. Um. So. so uh, you're probably gonna beat me. Just saying. Oh, uh, whatever. We don't know that. Modern, or, I mean, Classic Sonic might be my only way of winning. Yeah, I got Modern Sonic on most stages down. Yeah. So, um, I, I don't think I've told the viewers yet and I, that you might not know, but I want to be a clinical psychologist when I grow up. Ha! Hey, what's funny about that? I want to help people with their problems. And? What are you going to do, fix computers? Maybe. I'm oh. helping them with their computer problems. I know, that's what I was going for. <laughs> um. Well, I guess this is the end. But um, what I was saying, even though this is like right at the end, Hurry up. I think my video game skills and my psychology, sk my psychology outlook are about the same, because I'll explain next time. Yeah, you bet you will. <sighs> well... No, I'll keep explaining. No, it's Happy so birthday, fun. Sonic! Happy birthday! Even though we're like six months, seven, eight months, almost a year too late. Alright, well, that's the end of this episode. No. No, it's not. It's not. That's, that's right. That's what I'm saying. I'll keep talking. So, it, when it comes to therapy, there's a bunch of different, like, approaches to it. And a, there's one that's called the eclectic approach, which is pretty much mixing in all the approaches and becoming, instead of like mastering one approach, being like a jack of all trades. And I realized over. That's pretty much what I do in games. Like, well, I play a lot of games. And we'll see you next time. Yeah. No. No. It, it's almost over. We'll just explain it next time. No, I play a lot of games and I don't really... Like, I used to master them and I used to be really, really, really good at a few games. But then I started playing a bunch of different games. There's no time here. Now I'm just... I'm Even Eggman agrees with me. There is no time! Now I'm just like... <laughs> there is no time! <laughs> Who is he talking to? Me. Why is he wearing a cape? Because it's a classic. It depends on your definition of win. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I, I'm pretty much like a jack of all trades when it comes to gaming Maybe now. But when I was younger, I used to be like That's CJ, who played idea. not that many games, and used to get really, really, really good at those games. And, and we'll see much. you next time. Next time on Sonic Generations. Press start. See Sega online instruction for. Not rate. All oh, my interactions not rated by the ESRB. God, this TV sucks! Sega.